Al Cook requested 720 degrees. This came out in 1986 by Atari. So Al is a PayPal donator, so his requests get priority over everyone else. So that's how that's gonna work. So he's requested this and some other games, so they're gonna get done first. Um, so he wanted to you know, hear about the controls in this game. Um, so this game is, is a very unique control scheme. I played this as a kid, I think once in an arcade, so it has this joystick here. This joystick can only spin around, like you can't go to the center. It's, I don't know of any other game that's like that. So to emulate that, you could either try to use a regular joystick, or if you had like an analog stick or flight stick that worked, but I'm gonna use my spinner. Um, so I'm gonna go into input this machine, See, there's two buttons here. So there's a, like a, a speed up button and then a jump button. So you go to dial analog. And if you don't have it already set, you press delete and then you just spin your spinner. And um, if you do it, sometimes you have to do it fast. Wait, I didn't hit enter. So I hit, del yeah, I didn't hit enter. You gotta hit delete if there's something already there you don't want. A lot of times I just, yeah, I hit delete and hit enter. And there you go, mouse 2x. So this dial analog increase and decrease, you don't need to worry about that. Just leave that the way it is. That's for your joystick. So that way you could still use your joystick to control the guy if you wanted to. So, um, so then there's another thing, analog controls in here. See this digital speed? That only applies to the joystick, so you don't need to worry about it if you're using a spinner or an analog stick or something. So sensitivity, by default this was at 12, and uh, I kind of felt like that was a little like not strong enough, so I put it up to 20, and I think that feels good for the spinner. So uh, let's see what I can do. I'm not good at this game at all. There's the classic Atari Enter a Coin Sound. To start, you have to press like the speed up button. All right, so you got to choose your, uh, I'm going to the training level. That's, this game's hard. Uh, all right, let's go to jump park, I guess. And there's... Okay. You might immediately say, hey, wait, this looks like skate or die. Well, this came out two years before Skate or Die. And, um, so Skate or Die actually copied this game. Okay, so, ah, oh, shit. We jump, and then in the air. In the air, you spin. There you go, I landed. I'm using my spinner. Oh, shit. I didn't get to the end in time, I guess. Alright, so you, I got a bronze medal right there under jump. Alright. When you have a time limit, this time limit always ends up killing me. You can see how fast it's going down. Okay, there's a map. So we're there. And there's a pad shop. Um, board shop. I mean, maybe I'm just going to go up to Downhill Park. But you gotta get there, and if you don't get there fast enough, the music, the volume changed pretty drastically. It was really loud in that, that jump we were doing. You can't get in here if you don't have a ticket. Oh, I don't have a ticket. Well, how do I get a ticket? I gotta get 3,000 points. So, like, what do I have to just, like... Jump higher with better shoes. Skate or die. Did you hear that? He said skate or die. So now you know where they got the the title for the NES game. There's some money. Whoa. Skate or die, look at that. Game over. So yeah, this is an Atari game, but the uh Skate or Die, I think, came out by EA or something, or whatever EA was called back then. 
So look, that's it. No continues. I'm already, it's already, I'm already dead. So here's what I'm going to do. Cheat. If you don't have cheats enabled in main, you need to. Infinite area time. Let's see what I'm... See, there's infinite area time, then there's this metal park time, then there's this park time. I, I don't know what all that means. I'm just going to turn on infinite area time, infinite park time. Because uh, I'm not good enough. Alright. Training level. And this is on the easiest level. I'm going to pause it. Look, I'll go to... Uh, I'll go to dip switches. See, a lot of games you can go to dip switches and then you can see different settings. So look, it's on easy, believe it or not. And then there's medium, hard, hardest. Fuck that. All right. And then a lot of games you can do F2 while you're in the game and then you can see the game's actual settings menu that the actual arcade game had. Uh, did I do downhill? I don't even, I don't even remember. Oh yeah, I tried to go to downhill and I didn't have a ticket. What is this? Yeah, so I have a good choice, and you're gonna love it. Oh, I got a helmet. So yeah, the timer's not going down. That's way better. I want to be able to just yeah, just like go around and. But it's an arcade game, so they want kids to get off of it, so they can get more money. Give me that money. Come on. Pick it up, kid. There we go. Um. I don't know where I'm going. Rampart? There we go. Okay, score 3,000 better to win a medal. Hold jump button for more tricks. Okay. Okay. Hand plant. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. It's hard to tell which direction you're facing. I think you have to turn. There we go. I don't know. It's really hard. It's really hard to control. Does that music mean it's over? Oh, the music ended? I'm still going? Okay. Oh, maybe because of the cheat I did? This is confusing. Another thing I don't get is on the picture I showed earlier of the ar arcade control panel, I didn't see a button. So why do I have two buttons? But maybe th there was a button, I just didn't notice it. I don't know. Okay, so it's hard to tell like which direction is forward. Alright, so I don't know. And if he just if he just stays straight, he doesn't have any speed to go to the other side of the ramp. So I don't know. How do I how do I get out of here? Huh. Maybe I gotta turn that off? Or am I screwed? Maybe there's no way to get out now. Okay. I'm gonna do... Well, F2 doesn't do anything. See, most games F2 will take you to a settings menu. Uh, I guess I'm hitting F3. F3 and, almost, and like every game will reset the game. So I'll just leave it on infinite area time.
I'm gonna do training level still. Okay. So you can use your joystick also. So like right now I'm using my joystick. So you can do that instead if you prefer that. But I think it's harder to use the joystick. Okay. I can't exit. I'm pressing all the buttons. So this could be this could be caused by the fact that I'm using cheats. Sometimes cheats can cause weird stuff to happen in main games. So turn that off and do F3 again. That's all. That's all I can do. All right, now I get up. Play for real. Oh shit. Oh sh See, like here I'm at that same map. See, I'm pressing the button, I got out of it. Go. Okay. I see it said one ticket needed, and I think you start with a ticket. But, um, all right. This is gonna be tough, I think. Yeah, I gotta go through these gates. And I don't have time to see them. Bronze metal. I need a park tickets, so I need 2,450 tickets. Um, all right, there's no way that's gonna happen. Look at that, get 10,000 now. Let's try that. Um, well, I have it paused, so maybe that's why it didn't work. You gotta do, I don't know. My money still says 125, so I don't know. Pay here for what? There you go. I'm fine. I got shoes. I wonder how important getting all the stuff is, like shoes and pads and helmets. Uh, let's see if this guy lets me in. Skate or die. Skate or die. Hey, you can't get in here if you don't have a ticket. No. Um, I'm going to say on. Don't. And am I saved? No, I'm not saved. Look at my cash. It just went up really high. I don't know what's going on now. It's it, My score keeps increasing. Who knows? So maybe that's something you have to do before you start your next game? I don't know. I have a hundred dollars, I don't know. Uh... Infinite tickets. Screw it. Infinite park time and infinite tickets. How about that? Oh shit, we'll just do it all. Maximum everything. Maximum board, maximum shoes, pads, helmet. Sure. Oh shit. Ah! Oh, come on, why don't you land? There we go. Silver metal. Don't know why I got a silver. Search for hidden points. 
Okay. Gotta try not to hit, not to hit the map in case that screws up. Oh. Oh, it's closed because I already have maxed out stuff. Jump park. Oh shit. Okay. Ah, oh, splash. Failed to qualify. And I got a tongue like Rolling Stones logo. All right, can I try again? Oh, it's closed. All right. There's really futuristic cars in this. I don't know what year it's supposed to be. Day or die. I thought I had a limited time. It's closed. I thought I had a limited time. What the hell? Yeah, infinite park time. That's that's the uh, I don't know. I don't know what there's area time and there's metal slash park timer. See when I had infinite area time on before I got stuck in one place. I don't know. This game's too hard. I don't know how much easier it is with the original joystick. But that's, I mean, I don't know how you're going to emulate that without having the actual joystick. Good luck. speed thing? Because if it is, alright, I'll just... I won't try to jump. Silver. Atari made a lot of really good arcade games back then. Marble Madness, Zybots, APB, um, what the hell's the game? Vindicators. Vindicators. What else? I can't remember. Oh, get up. Because I'm using cheats. Yes, yeah, so seems like it confirms that using cheats screws that up. Anytime you get the map, you're screwed. Let me try yeah, that experience area. That'll go well. If I can even get to it. Okay, that. I got to it at least. Uh... I mean, it 
it's the same levels, it just maybe they just expect a higher score. Oh, this is, I suck at this. Yeah, I don't know the secret to this. Oh, I'm done. Okay. Oh, I have enough. I have 3,700 points. I have enough for a ticket. Okay. So, uh, where am I going? That was a hooker. Another one. Slalom, this is tough. Ah, I'm missing everything. Yeah, I failed to qualify. Man. Is anybody good at this game? Like, emulated on main? Is anybody? I mean, this guy's throwing frisbees at me. Ow. Ow! The audio sounds a lot like APB. Yeah. What is this? Here you go. I'm fine. I got pads. Great. Great or die. All right, I'm trying. God damn it! Where is it? Oh, it's closed. Oh, another Atari game. That just reminded me that the Swarm of Bees reminded me of Crystal Castles. I think that's Atari. That game's awesome. I did a video of that. Well, this game, I, I, I'm sorry to say I don't really like this game because I'm so bad at it. You know, I'll try it one more time for the hell of it. Uh, guess I'm doing experience. I don't know why. So, uh, where am I going? Jump, jump part. All right. Jump park is the most fun, I think. Let's go. Ah. Ah. Shit. Ah, I failed qualifying. I wasn't going fast enough, I guess. I don't know. Can I make it? Well, I'm not going to have enough money. No matter what I do. Or points. He's gonna say, Ah! Hey, you can't get in here if you yeah. don't have a ticket. Straight or die! Straight or die! That's it. I don't know what else to do. Damn. So if you're good at skater, if you're I mean, not skater, if you're good at 720, let me know what I'm doing wrong. And, uh, you know, the best way to control this, because it's hard to control. And again, I'm using a spinner. I tried a joy my joystick, and that, you know, it doesn't, doesn't really work well. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching.